Today we're going to look at another one of my 2017 Peterbilt 389s. Uh, this is pretty standard of the truck that I build. 290 wheelbase, 550 Cummins, 18 speed, 1850 torque, 336 rears, um, heavy duty drive line. We, we'll get into all that. Uh, but this one is, is a new color that Peterbilt just came out with. Just available this year on the 17s. It's called Legendary Brown. Um, I don't know how well this camera is picking up the flake and the and the and the pearl in it, but it's just absolutely an awesome, awesome color. Um, don't know if it's limited, if they'll, if they'll take this color away after a year or so. Don't know, but um, I was kind of nervous about ordering it, uh, but it's just gorgeous. I, 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 I'm, I'm really, really happy with it. This truck sits on Low Pro 24.5s, uh, polished alcohol wheels all the way around. Disc brakes on all three axles. Uh, if you guys have been watching my other videos, uh, they're not standard yet. The front axle disc brakes are standard. I'm putting disc brakes on the rears of all my trucks. The uh, For what they cost versus the downtime and the parts cost of drums and shoes, the, there's no way you can't justify putting those on there. They, they will save you and make you money. Phoenix LED light kit up the back of the fender, under the cab, under the sleeper, polished step box. Uh, I've got four batteries in there. Most everybody puts three. Uh, it's not much more money. Go ahead, do it right. Do four. Uh, big battery disconnect. If it's going to be parked for a while, that'll kill power to absolutely everything. So your batteries are good when you get back. I can also, uh, for you guys that order trucks from me, you can mount that inside the box so it's a little bit cleaner look. Uh, some guys like it on the outside, some on the inside. Either way, uh, polished aluminum air tanks, stainless elbows on the exhaust, seven inch exhaust with the curved tips. Power heated stainless uh, mirrors, uh, even the spots, they're heated, stainless visor, four horns, uh, like that old school look, air cleaner lights front and rear, uh, of course during the day they're clear when they're off, uh, the, these are all amber or orange and on the front of the air cleaner and the, and the rear ones are, are red like they're supposed to be. 15 inch premium air cleaners. Best air cleaner Peterbilt offers. Polished def tank cover. Polished tanks with four polished straps. I've got toolboxes on both sides of the frame. And of course they're polished and they're locking. Six lights in the rear. And uh, look up there, there's the antenna mount. Keeps it off the mirrors, trying to clean it up a little. Uh, chrome stand. Of course, the deck plate package. The 30 inch Hodge built quarter fenders. Uh, you know, they, they dip down nice, close, low to the ground. Nice custom touch. Of course, all the polished wheels. This truck has low Pro 24.5 Bridgestones all the way around. Rides around on low air leaf suspension. 336 gears. Shot of those disc brakes. Maybe. There we go. Uh, like I said, I've said previously, 700,000 miles. Very common on these for pads and rotors. And if you can catch. <clears throat> The rotors before the, the the pads do any damage to them at all, uh, you, you'll never put a set of rotors on it. One hundred and fifty gallon tank on this side, one thirty five on the other. Of course, the passenger step box, uh, which is also the uh, DPF filter cover. It's uh, it's polished. Another shot of that. Exhaust. 
that's that's a light when you open the door light comes on uh, lighted entry step lighted entry step cab light is what they call that another shot of that paint like I said just such a it's a neat color we haven't had anything with a metallic like this in a long time uh, real old school not quite a not quite a bass boat finish but but it's glittery just a great looking ride from the front uh, that polished around HID headlights just an 18 inch plain simple Texas bumper uh, this thing's gonna look just mean as can be coming down the road crack the hood back real quick Five hundred and fifty horsepower in this Cummins ISX fifteen, uh, eighteen fifty torque, heated fuel filter. All of the fuel lines on this truck have the Arctic wrap, um, and then also for protection, I, I, I put the best insulation package I could put in the in the cab and the sleeper, and that's the floor, the walls, the ceilings, the doors. That's great in the winter to keep it warm, but on a day like today when it's 100, 105 and the air conditioner's running, it helps keep it cool. And, and that's where that little bit of money is worth every, every penny. Front disc brakes, remote lube, remote jump uh, if you ever need it. Two-speed fan clutch. It's pretty standard. Uh, just like all the lights on, on the light kit, they were all pre-wired from the factory. This is pre-wired for fog lights. If you want to put a set of fog lights, the, it's already in the dash. It's ready to go. Just plug and play. take a peek inside I'm gonna start it hopefully the fan and the and the engine noise don't don't come through the microphone so heavy you can't hear me uh, it will come through a lot louder than what it actually is but that's part of filming off an iPhone uh, buckskin interior which is really a, kind of a two-tone tan uh, rosewood on the doors on the dash full rosewood dash Sears Atlas 80 series seats this seat reclines and slides back further than any other seat you can get from the factory so you taller guys um, it's a must and I personally think it's the most comfortable seat I, I touted those Peterbilt seats for years the Nationals but I'm pretty well sold on these series they're, they're just they're just the next step up Spare switches are, are, are pre-wired. Uh, they too are just plug and play. Uh, if you're going to add add something, of course, 
you got all your bright bezel gauges here. Six more there. I guess technically those are bright bezel. Sorry the video's not so good. It's a lot later in the day than when I normally do this. Uh, I've just been behind and this, uh, I'm playing catch up. But we'll get there. Uh, single bunk with all the cabinets on the rear wall plus the upper, upper storage. This has every option in the sleeper. There's, there's nothing else you can add to this from the factory. Uh, trays, drink holders, there's a power port there. Curtains on the windows. There's a control center. Two power ports. Uh, of course your bunk light. Refrigerator. Pretty standard refrigerator that we've been putting in for years and years. I know it's hard to see, I apologize. Just a standard closet here. center pull out you can do folding files some guys do clothes you know just whatever uh, pull out desk great place to put your laptop good place to do do your paperwork Bridgestones that are on it. If you want a different brand of tire, I've got them, uh, and I can probably swap them out for the, for the price of just the labor. So, so don't let don't let some of the easy to fix things steer you away from one of my trucks uh, because I don't mind changing things. My name's Steve Carboni. My phone number is at the bottom of the, of the screen here. Uh, you can call or text me anytime. I have financing. I take trades. Uh, I've sold hundreds and hundreds of these. Uh, I can help you with anything you've got going. If your credit's not perfect, but you've got some money or you've got some equity in a trade, call me. We'll talk about it. You're not going to tell me anything I've never heard. I promise you that. Um, get a chance check out my Facebook page Peterville Steve give it a like uh, subscribe to this channel uh, I plan on adding videos at a little more rate, rapid pace here pretty soon and uh, uh, if I can help you with anything even if you've just got a question I gave a guy a paint coat the other day he, he shot me a VIN number and I just gave him a paint coat to, to help him out so uh, I don't mind you may call 918-808-5638 and uh, let me help you if I can Appreciate it.